Hi, and welcome to the fourth video of the React Native animation series. If it's your first time tuning in, be sure to check out some of my other videos and leave a like or a tip if you find the video helpful. The link to the source code for this tutorial is provided in the video description. So far, we've covered the React Native animated API, the transform property, animated values, animated components, and interpolation. If you're not familiar with any of these concepts, be sure to check out the first couple of videos of this playlist. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to implement a basic on-scroll animation that will hide the header as you scroll down in your app and restore the header as you scroll back up. To give you an example, I've got this app right here, which has a banner at the top, a banner image, and a bunch of text. When I scroll here, as you can see, the header disappears. The status bar also changes, the time and icons on the, on the right change color, and when I scroll back up, the header then slides back down. In my main app file, I've got the source code for the app I just highlighted. The first component here is the status bar. The bar style is set to light content because we have a dark header. Beneath that, we have a safe area view component. Inside our safe area, we have the header component and a scroll view, which contains the banner image and all of our text. Let's start off by specifying a function to call when we scroll through our screen. So on our scroll view, we can add a prop called on scroll. We'll then call a function, let's name it on scroll event, which will handle our scroll. Let's go ahead and create this function. When this function is called, an event will be passed. And from this event, we can get the current scroll position by simply getting the Y position since we're scrolling vertically. Let's go ahead and console log the result. Back on the scroll view, let's add another prop called scroll event throttle, which specifies after how many milliseconds should the on scroll event be fired. Now when you scroll in the app, you'll see that the scroll position is being console logged. Let's go ahead and remove this. Next, let's create a state to indicate whether our header should be displayed or not. We'll hide our header if the scroll position is greater than 100. And if it's less, we'll restore the header. In our header style prop, we'll add the transform property and set the translate y value to negative 100 to hide the header. Translate y will basically move our header vertically so if we set a value to negative 100, it will basically move the banner up. Setting the value to zero will keep it in the current position. This is enough to hide and restore the header as we scroll through our app, but there's no animation applied yet. Let's also adjust the height of our banner depending on the show header state to fix the spacing issue we've got here. So to animate the banner, we need to use an animated component and an animated value. Let's go ahead and import animated from React Native. 
We'll then change our scroll view to an animated scroll view. Let's also create an animated value like we did in the previous videos. This will be our translate Y value. Lastly, like we did in the previous video, we can listen for the show header state change and animate the header translate value from 0 to negative 100 if show header is false using animated.timing. So that's it for this video, stay tuned for the next one. If you found this video helpful, be sure to leave a like, a tip or subscribe if you'd like to see more content like this. Until next time, cheers.